Hi there, I'm Lydia Walker from RusticSongbird.com and in this video I'm going to share with you four ways that you can put your lyrics to music. Let's get started. If you're a lyricist, you write lyrics, but you struggle with putting those lyrics to music, I hope that these quick tips will help you out. My first tip is to think up a melody for your song or at least have some kind of idea of what you might want it to sound like and just record it onto your phone. I use the voice memos on my phone and I'll either hum into the voice memos to capture whatever I'm thinking or I'll sing a little bit and come back to it later or I can even talk about what I want it to sound like. For example, this might be a sad song so it might be a little slower or this is really happy and peppy. So anything like that you can get down on your phone and your voice memos can help you remember when you look at it later on. The second way is to learn an instrument. This is great if you already know an instrument. You can just play around with it, listen to different notes, and maybe put those in different orders and just see what sounds right to you, see what sounds good. If you don't know an instrument, you can Google different chords for how to play guitar and look up guitar chords and where to put your fingers and just practice changing from a few different chords. You could even learn a few chords in one key. For example, G, C, D and just play those three chords over and over or different variations of those chords, you can use a capo to transpose those into any key. If this is way over your head, don't worry about it, but I'm just saying you can Google it, check it out, maybe try something new, and that's a great way to learn to put music to your song. The third tip that I have for you is an exercise where you can put your lyrics to the tune of a familiar song that's already been written. I have several friends who have rewritten the words to a hymn like Amazing Grace and they make their own version of that. I think that's a great exercise especially as you're learning or as you're trying to figure out how to make your lyrics singable. You can take a song that you do like and maybe look at the lyrics online or print off the lyrics and just rewrite those or put your lyrics to that same form and see, okay, how are they rhyming that? And maybe just sing that melody to your lyrics. That's a great exercise, so you should try that. I remember the first time I realized that Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and the ABC song were the exact same melody. It blew my mind. Just think about it for a second. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star A B C D E F G it blew my mind. See what I mean? So you can take a song that already has a great melody and just change the lyrics to it as an exercise. Of course you don't own that music, but it's a great way to get your song into a singable format and you can always change it later if you want to. Some people just naturally hear melodies in their head and can make up tunes or melodies to a song and it comes naturally. So if you're one of those people, that's great, but if you're not, it's a little difficult to describe how that works. If it's not your gift, I can't teach that. But I can encourage you to do the fourth tip, which is to find a musician to collaborate with. This is a great way to include someone else and have their perspective added to your song. Maybe explain how you want it to sound, like I mentioned earlier, if, whether it's a sad song or a happy song or if you have an idea for it. And meet up with someone who plays guitar or who plays piano or another instrument. Give them your idea and see what they come up with. It might be even better than what you had hoped or what would have come of it if you just left it in your notebook. I want to encourage you to just reach out to somebody and try it. You never know what can happen until you try. So I hope that these four tips help you out in putting your lyrics to music. There are an infinite amount of ways to do that so be encouraged that your music and your songs are important. Keep doing your thing, keep writing, and I will see you again in the next video. If you liked this video please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below, share it with your friends, and make sure to subscribe for more great videos coming soon about songwriting. Thanks for watching. Make sure to grab your free download of my basic songwriting format linked in the description below. I'll see you in the next video.